here. That's what it said on the signs. longer extension that's a two that's a metric to get these screws out I had a magnetic end but one of these bolts was still in there user must use the glue stick to apply adhesive to build the surface before the first print otherwise the print may adhere too strongly and could damage the plate when removing the product all right that up there. <laughs> Just keep that. So I'm going to get all of this packing material out and then um, we'll start assembling the other parts that came with it like the screen that goes up here. Just snap in there. Good. All right, so we got that. This is back on. Set it up. That's going to connect. in. We're going to plug this into our surge protector. Make sure everything's good. Oh, it did something. Alright, let's go ahead and turn it on again just to look at everything. Oh, it lit up here. We want to do English next. We want to do scan the QR code to log into the printer. All right. All right. So we got everything connected. I'm going to agree to that. I'll let it do its thing. There we go. I get all the parts out from under it. Looks like I did. Alright, it says calibration complete, so we're going to go next installation. Hooked up, the firmware is there. We did a calibration, but we stopped it because we didn't actually want to do a print. We removed yet. this desiccate out right here out of its package so that it can take moisture out. Now we're gonna pop this piece off. We're gonna take this desiccant out. That way it can remove the moisture. So we're gonna take that out and then we'll do the same thing on the opposite side. All right, so we've got to put some glue on this so that we can release whatever we make on there. I assume anywhere where it could print something, even if it's a small one. Got from that I've in seen. place now. It's magnetic, so it's going to snap down. And I believe we can go ahead and turn it on and feed the PLA in. And then we'll turn it on and let it calibrate. All right, uh, and then later, we haven't printed anything yet. It's just, so I'm gonna go through English next. Uh, we've already done Wi-Fi. We are going to, all right, so it's logged me in. I agree. And next, so now it's gonna calibrate. 
Yeah. I've already uploaded the firmware. I've already put the glue on there. It's doing the calibration process. All right, so now it says calibration complete. So we're gonna go to next. See if it gives us a choice here. Uh, bed scraper, 15 minutes. Let's do that. We're gonna do it in PLA. Let's go ahead and hit print now. So before I do a time lapse of that, let's just watch and see what it does at the initial part. And I'll let it, it's probably doing all the auto leveling and the testing. And... All right, now it's doing the auto bed leveling. So and you can see it right up here, it's telling you what it's doing. All right, right now it says sweeping XY. So there's nine minutes left. So it did this little test piece here and got all the little pieces off and now it's actually building the scraper in a different location. It's still cooling down. This is 96 degrees Celsius. All right, it looks like it's done. 31 degrees Celsius, 27 degrees Celsius there, 26 degrees here. So I think we're safe to go ahead and open that up and get this off. Now, we did make a scraper here, but we're gonna make another one in the next video. Okay, now, I do not know how I'm supposed to take this stuff off. Now that I can do with my finger now, but that's the whole reason I wanna make the scraper, the other scraper, because in this box, Bamboo Labs sends you, and I think those are razor blades, that go on a different scraper. So that's what we're gonna make the next video about. Find is something that is plastic. Oh, there we go. All right, there we go. So there's our little scraper. That's so we can use that to kind of clean the surface. All right, so that works out pretty good. So there's our first print.